Now you need to keep in mind that this this is a piece of electronic equipment and it is rather fragile. Um, for most laptops, uh, the problems that we've seen in the past usually occur with the hinge. So you want to make sure when you're closing it, you're not slamming it hard. Um, you're, you're using a little bit of care and you're holding down the bottom um, of the computer and then closing it slowly and down. And as we mentioned in another clip, um, when you open it back up, um, it has gone into a locked mode, so you need to put in your password to, to get back into your files. But you want to be very careful with that hinge um, and treat this machine very gently. Um, okay. Um, one thing you'll notice on, uh, on my computer in the screen here at the bottom, um, in the uh, little area where the clock is there, I forget the exact term for that. Um, you'll see a little little black arrow inside a white box there. And that tells me that there is an update waiting to the Chrome operating system. Um, and if I want to apply that update, what I need to do is click on that area. And you'll see that it says restart to update. Um, so that's all you have to do is click on that and the update will be installed. And you'll notice that it is much, much faster than a Windows computer. Um, this is a very lightweight operating system. It doesn't eat up a lot of memory. Um, and it, it should restart fairly quickly. And there we go, it's coming back up. Um, you do not need to worry about uh, antivirus protection. You don't need to worry about backups. Um, if you're using a Chromebook, uh, whether it's the schools or your own, um, you do not want to let anyone try to sell you any software. There is nothing to install. Um, you don't have to worry about updates. They're all automatically done. Okay. 